You go to Walmart, you go shopping. You know, you don't know if the person has a shot beside you or not, but we also know that it doesn't matter if you have one shot or 10 shots, you can catch COVID. See, the Prime Minister has triple shots, and I, I know hundreds of people with three shots that caught COVID. We just have to be careful. We've got to always make sure we wash our hands. And, and so in this uh, article, they're letting us know that uh, Jason Kenney, the Premier of Alberta, February 14th, that the children in Alberta will no longer need to wear masks from kindergarten to grade 12. So here's uh, just some highlights. Uh, Premier Jason Kelly. Kenny announced his plan to lift COVID-19 restrictions beginning tonight. Quebec also plans to lift most pandemic restrictions by mid-March. Saskatchewan is to end the COVID-19 proof of vaccine policy on February 14th. Mandatory masking to remain only until the end of the month. More restrictions to be eased in PEI. Um, Newfoundland and Labrador easing more restrictions. So I just wanted to post what Doug Ford said that whether you're vaccinated or unvaccinated, you can still contract COVID and you can still be contagious and you can still spread it around. He points out that our uh, Prime Minister Justin Trudeau is triple vaccinated and still contracted COVID. And then while he had COVID, he was, you know, contagious. So the whole border uh, restrictions for the truckers is based on the rationale that we want all the truckers to be vaccinated so that when they cross the border, they're safe and they're not spreading COVID. But at this point, if the science is saying that with the new variants at the moment, the vaccinations can lower the severity of illness, but it doesn't mean that it'll prevent you from getting COVID or getting it and spreading it. So if we're at the point where both vaccinated and unvaccinated are in the same boat, and as far as transmission of the disease, the vaccination or unvaccinated, it doesn't matter. You could still contract it. So that's why the mandates at the border should really be uh, removed. And the peaceful prot protesters in Ottawa should uh, be able to go back home, get their, li their livelihood back, this whole situation should should be like this. You want to wear a mask, wear a mask. You want to stay home and hide, stay home and hide. If you want the vaccine, get the vaccine. And if you don't want it, don't get it. Now just let us all, you know, get back to our life. We've done this for two years. Instead, we have Justin Trudeau, um, you know, basically sounding the alarms and, and doing this emergency act which is for times of war and and great catastrophes not a bunch of peaceful truckers that are on wellington street in front of parliament by the way there's nothing being blocked guys all of ottawa can circulate as they wish except for a small part on wellington that's blocked off so I've been, uh, I went this weekend, my wife's been a few times, just look at Viva Frey and other people uh, that have been streaming online. Uh, it's a peaceful protest. It, it, there was children there, there was babies in, in carriages and families walking around. It was uh, loving, it was peaceful. And Justin Trudeau now is basically, you know, calling martial law for these peaceful uh, protesters and not stopping the mandates at the border when Doug Ford is part of the provincial government and is basically saying the truth that doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if you're vaccinated or not. You shouldn't, you shouldn't be worried if somebody's vaccinated or unvaccinated because potentially we can all still catch and spread it around. So be safe and be smart and live your life. That's what we need. We just got to live our life now. All right, see you. <laughs> See why I keep coming home smiling? Hey? I feel like I'm at a love party every weekend. <laughs> so much violence though. I, it's, oh, I know, look at all the violence. So I stepped violence. my toe and it's violently painful because it broke. <laughs> so many can these these are freedom canned goods. At the violent Ottawa protest. This protest has the people with the cleanest and whitest teeth I've ever seen. With all the free toothpaste.
beautiful buildings that are worthless. <laughs>